This is my Raspberry Pi 3, which I just got from the Pi Hut and just received it today. And it's running uh, Coding Media Center on the seven inch touchscreen uh, monitor. And uh, we have a USB or battery powered uh, speaker that's taking the audio out just there. Let's power it up. Now with, with the stand, uh, we have to rotate uh, the LCD display. Now that's taken care of. And you can see the four pies there indicating that this is a quad core CPU. That's starting up and as you can see uh, we're using the GPIO um, headers there for power. Uh, I am using the onboard wireless connection and I have a wireless keyboard plugged in uh, just in case. I'm still going through the configuration for things here. Uh, but let's use the touchscreen interface to run Kodi. As you can see here, it's connected to the wireless network and you have some files. On the touchscreen interface, it takes a little bit of getting used, used to, but it, it involves double taps in order to select things and to get them to play. So this is Big Buck Bunny, the Peach Project from Blender. So as you can see, reasonably bright, nothing really taxing the CPU. Sound is reasonably good. And there you have it, that is the Raspberry Pi 3, just set up today, and the uh, coding media center running on it, uh, with the 7 inch touchscreen, that's the official one. Uh, I will have a, a more detailed uh, step by step um, unboxing and uh, breakdown uh, of the, the steps for configuration, installation and so on, uh, a little bit later in the week. Hopefully, uh, so be sure to uh, subscribe uh, and uh, look forward to uh, to seeing that maybe by the weekend. So there you have it, the Raspberry Pi three in action with the seven inch touch screen. Thank you.